You're here. Congress is still in session. George Washington and his militia have fired on French troops under Jumonville. The French are calling it an act of war. George Washington. You mean Lawrence's younger brother? Yeah, it's the same. I'm speaking of Lawrence Washington. But you eliminated him. James Wardrop has moved up in ranks. All the Templar resources are at his disposal now. What about the manuscript? My sources in New York confirm that Wardrop has it. I also learned that he is here at the Congress under heavy guard. Shay, find Wardrop. Get that manuscript. This place is thick with Templar troops. Liam and I will make sure he doesn't escape. With respect, I cannot just let anyone inside. We're... Ah, uh, that must be the Templar William Johnson. Perhaps he has the manuscript, or knows where it is. As I have stated previously, I believe we need a national union, granted by an act of parliament but bringing greater independence to our colonies. The French are an immediate threat, and we are ill-prepared to face them. To put it bluntly, the colonies must join, or die. A rousing speech, Master Franklin. But do you truly believe Great Britain will grant our colonies autonomy? They have little choice, Master Johnson. You know the remoteness of this frontier better than most. Yes. But let us leave politics for another day. I wanted to thank you for your research. Of course. Of course. In the brief time I could examine that box, I could tell it was something unique. From ancient Egypt, you said? Well, as I mentioned in my letter, I am quite ready to electrify it. Excellent. We will have the box delivered shortly. As for the manuscript... Captain? I apologize, sir, but Master Wardrop refused to hand it over. He said the risks were too great. The risks? Ah. I apologize. You will have the manuscript and the box in the briefest of delays. You made an excuse for a uniform. Run to Fort Frederick and tell Master Wardrop he had better cough up the manuscript post-haste. Else I will have him scalped. Can't let that lobster captain reach Wardrop. I suppose it depends on King George. I think we need a stronger colonial government, with or without. Bastards in me sights. Yeah. You come back here, you mad maggot! Can't let that lobster captain reach wardrobe. 
suppose it depends on King George. I think we need a stronger colonial government. Keep at it, boys! <laughs> Take that, you Templar dog. No! You have no idea what you're doing, fool! Keeping the people free from your control. How free will you be when the French undermine these squabbling colonies? These colonies would be far better off without the Templars pulling the strings. <laughs> we bring order from chaos. If everything is permitted, no one is safe. Even the devil can quote scripture to suit his own purposes. Take me, bring you down! Got you lined up. I've cleared the gun.
I have the manuscript. Great. Hope is waiting for you in Sleepy Hollow. What's in Sleepy Hollow? Benjamin Franklin. The man Johnson tried to make that strange precursor box work. So what's the plan? Meet Hope. Impersonate one of Johnson's men. And get the box and manuscript to Franklin. So I'm a messenger then. Aye. See if this Franklin can figure out how this damn box operates. Stay with him. Oh, as far as we can tell, this man doesn't know about the Templars or the assassins of that man. Oh, a simple task. <laughs> For a simple man. And a sleepy hollow. Send his pawn into six distant there. Cormac at the helm. Blues and trip too. Get the mainsails into the wind. Let loose the mains. War with France is inevitable. You're late. The sky is getting temperamental. That's not the only thing, is it? Uh, Master Franklin, sir. My name is Shay, and this is my associate, Hope. Uh, William Johnson told us to give you these. Ah. Thank you, but I'm afraid I must delay my experiment. Delay it? Why? The army confiscated my lightning rods. They are essential to conducting the electricity. I need to vivify your box. Master Johnson would not want you to have to wait. Perhaps there is something you can do, then. Soldiers have been hauling things away all day. Perhaps they could tell you where they've taken my lightning rods so you could get them back. At your service, sir. Begin your investigation at the market near the docks. I will stay here and help with the preparations. This is intolerable. I can barely conduct my research anymore. Soldier. Aye, sir. 
Is there anything we can do to stop the spread of typhoid fever? I'm sure you're seeing things, but I'll take a bucket. See that strange stuff in Benjamin Franklin's garden. I keep well clear of that place. They say that night messes with right. Hey, get up! What's wrong with you? Out of the North 12 and Monday, and in the of the week 164. I wonder what Master Franklin plans to do with these rods. The storms get worse. Let's hurry back to Franklin. Take 
brown vest on your shoulder while you march. Dive or fire on. Never forget. Leave your best friend when trouble rears its head. Watch to the marrow in no time. Goodness! Uh, quick! Help me with the rods! Portugal, Lisbon, I'd stake my life on it. Make yourself scarce, Shay. The militia will be here any minute. I'm sure they will have questions. What about you? I'm a devoted housekeeper. Right. Mount Vernon. Hope will be expecting me. 